Monkey 1000 and today I have oh oh can't get it out I have a Timu haul and more Timu and another Timu and another Timu also I have I have one more Timu so stay tuned and we'll be doing Timu Hey guys we're back and um yeah so my first one i'm going to do i have already unboxed it i wanted to see what it was didn't wasn't sure what it was so but i left it in the bag for you guys so you guys can see it this i bought for my laptop my new laptop that you guys probably saw and it's really nice this is so I can take my laptop with us if we go somewhere. I'm going to bring you guys down a little bit so you guys can see a little bit better. There you go. And this is for a, um, what do they call this? 17 to 17.3 inches um, computer. So, um, yeah, I like it. It's, it's like a, I don't know what you call this. Um, it's like a vinyl kind of material. But it's waterproof and uh, you have it's by they call call it vuva is the name of it very nicely packaged really nice even see the zippers they they have plastic on them i didn't take plastic off of it yet and then you have a pocket right here and then you have where you can put your stuff in here too so i think that's pretty nice they do come in different colors I did pay $18.89 for this. And the colors they come in black, uh, blue, and gray, and then pink. So it does have a nice handle on here. Looks very nice. Feels nice. Then after this zipper here, then you have, let's try to open this. You have this big the big zipper for the laptop my laptop does fit in here it works pretty good so it'll be fine in here and it has nice cushioning in there for your laptop which i liked very nice it comes with a strap i just haven't put it on yet and then you have another pocket in the back and it's velcro and you got lots of room in there you can put all kinds of stuff in there and there you go i thought this was really nice this would be great for college students you know that are have to take their laptop to college and they want to go through campus and stuff like that a business person who who take takes their laptop for traveling or whatever i think these are really nice um yeah and it's stylish too I like it a lot so that was my first one that I got um, all right so we'll open up the small packages first um, we'll do this one I know what this one is here okay this is for Bruno yeah all righty I paid $4.58 for this I'm sure that's what it's for. Bruno. Oh, it's not gonna. Let me just cut. Whoa. I'm gonna hurt myself with the scissors here. We don't need that. So we'll open it up this way. I want to cut it. Okay. This is a pad for Bruno's food and stuff. I have a couple of them. Um, but um, they need to get washed, and then I don't have anything under. So if I, I got this one to put underneath his food and that, I thought it was cute. And it gives me an extra one. When one, one's in the wash, then I can, and I can do this one. So I got that for Bruno. And he doesn't even know yet. <laughs> so let me see what this is. 
okay, I know what this is. Let me find it. And sometimes you can tell by the feel <laughs> of stuff that um, what things are. Okay, so this here, let me see, will I open up? Mm, not really. Alright. So, okay. This is a charger I got. I noticed that the one I have, the, the cord is starting to mess up on it. And so I wanted to get a new one. So I got a new cord. I hope this is going to work for my phone. And it came with the block. They call these blocks, I guess. And it comes with the block. And it comes with the cord. And um, I paid $6.09 for this. It's dual fast 20 watt USB fast charger. So it should charge kind of fast. Let me see if I can get this undone here. And hopefully it'll work for my cell phone. Because <laughs> that's what I bought it for, really. Because the other charger I've had for a long time, it's not for this phone. It came with another phone, and I was like, eh. So this is long. I don't know how long this is. Um, let me see. Let me see how long it shows. One pink package. It doesn't say how long the cord is, but it's pretty good size, long length. You know, it is a good length. So let's see. I'm at 98%. Oh, it fits there. And let's see if we we fit it here. It has it for the wider one too. And then you got the center one. So let's try put it in. It, that is so, it's showing 98%. You can see up there. And let's see how fast it goes to 100. Oh, there it goes. Okay. And we'll see. Let's check it out. And we'll, we'll continue. All right, so I got that. All right, this other one here. I don't know. There might be a bunch of stuff in this one. Uh, let me see. Uh, I really don't know what's in this one. Um, hmm. It could be this one. It might be this one. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll find out. Um. So the last couple of days, I've been getting a bunch of them in. I don't know. These are packaged. I don't know. They're separately packaged. Is this the same what I think it is? I don't know. Why would they do that? I don't know. I think I know what this is, guys. This is... Well, let's open it up so you guys can see what it is, right? Yeah. Hmm. Well, I only I already got this. Yep, it's doing it again. Oh my god. Why are they doing this? And I only paid for it one time. Yeah. They gave me these again. Wow. And I've gotten two more. I did not order these. I, I ordered the one and I did it in my other video. My receipt says I only ordered one item. You get two of these. You get two of these for one item. So are they getting confused because one, you know, it's coming from, a, someone was trying to say they're coming from local warehouses, but I'm not paying for these. And they did it on another one that I had. And I didn't pay for it either. That's strange. Really strange. So I got two more of these. They're the same flavor. Peach. Like I did on the last video. If you had seen it. And these are eleven sixty one, But I did not pay for these. It even shows that I had one item. One item. If you guys can see that. You see? 
shows one item. I did not buy these. So I guess I got them for free. Okie dokie. Wasn't expecting that. Not at all. Okay. Hmm. That's strange. Really strange. And that happened to me on the other one, too. That's, that's really weird. Is anybody getting that? Oops, sorry. I hit the mic. Is anybody else having this problem? Dang. I only want, and, and someone was trying to say, well, one's coming from the local warehouse and the other one's coming from, well, if I only bought it once, it should only come from one place, not two different places. So are they getting the orders are going out to, to do two different places and they think, well, this is just the one order. Doesn't make sense. That's strange. Very strange. But I did not see anything where I was charged, only charged for the, you know, the two came together for 11 something. So, um, yeah, they come in a set. That's amazing. So, I don't know if they're making mistakes, something's happening. I don't know. That's very strange. It is strange. All right, so what I'm going to do is open this one up. This package here and then we'll we'll go through it because there's lots in this one well not lots but there's there's enough in here okay we'll tuck it over here okay so we'll bring one out at a time or maybe not okay we'll do this one all right this right here came on this order. Uh, that should be. Let me see what one it is. All right. These. This is a hanger. Hmm. That's strange. Hmm. I bought this this to hang up some of my mom's pants. Um, she needed another one, so I thought I'd try a different one. And this is what it looks like. It's very cheap. Very cheap. This is probably not going to last too long, I don't think. This hook is very, very cheap. This is plastic over here. And then these are kind of... I don't know what you call these. They're not, they're not steel or anything like that. They're, they say they stainless steel. These are not stainless steel. What do they call these dang things? They're hollow inside, but I wouldn't call them stainless steel. Now I got one of these and it says two pieces, but I only got one. <laughs> so I don't know if the other one's coming or if there's another one in there, but I don't think so. So I mean, I'll probably keep it. It was $5.19 for one. So, I don't know. I, I find it very, very cheap. Cheaply made. Um, yeah, very cheaply made. And very misleading. <coughs> Excuse me, because it says right here that you get two pieces two pieces and I got one so I mean this is one one and I got two it says two and uh it's 552 at the moment um so and I paid 519 for it so I would not buy this I really wouldn't I don't think it's going to be sturdy enough it's not going to last long I think this is going to break right here no you know um but we'll see i'll let you guys know see how well it works but there's only one in there all right <laughs> the other thing i got sorry we bought an air fryer and you probably saw it on Shea Bear's um, channel. He did a thing on the air fryer. And uh, 
we like it. It's nice. I'm glad we got the one with the window in it and we got the bigger one. For three of us, I think that's what we need um, is the bigger one. If you get the smaller one, you know, if there's only one person, you want to get a smaller one, it'd probably be fine for you. So I got this. It's called the Air Fryer. It's a cooking guide and it tells you all your your baking temperatures and stuff like that that you need so um for your air fryer i got all these in the top i paid two dollars and 67 cents for this which is not bad i yeah. you you get a magnet here here's more here so you guys can see it you get a magnet here so you can put it on your fridge and attach it to the back and you can hook it up on your fridge so it's easy and convenient for you when you're when you're cooking and stuff so that's the other page what it looks like and this page this is frozen section this gives you all the stuff about the frozen foods and stuff like that and your cooking stuff on that for your fryer your air fryer that's what I mean air fryer so I got that okay now what's this in here okay now I, I bought um, nail wraps I wanted to see how well they work and I like them I, they're not that hard to do and I do like them but I needed to get something for my nails to keep them from getting brittle and stuff. So, um, hold on, guys. Hey guys, I'm sorry. Shea Bear is getting mad at a, a marketer. They call him constantly. So he picks them up and tells them off and all kinds of stuff. So I didn't know if you guys could hear it because he's in the bedroom. But I could hear it. So, anyways, this is called Nail Dehydrator and Primer for your nails so i thought maybe i'd try this this helps your strengthening your nails and this one helps to hydrate your nail so i wanted to see how well this would work and this is three dollars and 98 cents i will tell you the bottles are a lot smaller than what you see on here let me show you yeah this is what they look like on here and this is what you get here. Yeah. So, you know, they're really small. But we'll see how well it works and see if it's even worth that amount of money. As far as I'm concerned, this should have been a dollar or something. You know, I think you get more at Dollar Tree and they're bigger for $1.25. So, I don't know. We'll try it though. No big deal. I'll try it. Okay. Uh, let me see what else I got in here. Okay. All right. So I bought a new cell phone, as you know, and um, this, let's check this thing out and see. Oh, it's already at 100%, guys. So there you go. Can you guys see that? I hope so. Yeah, I think you guys can. Yeah. So it's at 100% already there we go and um so that's okay anyway so i messed my butterfly that i had on the back here it, it really helps i like them because i can put my finger in there and i drop my phone a lot so i need something to help me so i got me another butterfly i bought that one and i didn't like it so I still have it, but I'm, I'm probably never going to use it. And so I got me another one to put on the back, the, the one that I had before. So this is a lot better. This is going to fit on the back here with no problem. Let's see. And then I can put my finger through here and hold my phone. So I'll put that on. And it comes with the peel. And you just peel it off and then put it on there. So, yeah. So I got one of those, and how much did I pay for it? Um, a dollar seventy-eight for that. So it's cute, and they come in different colors too. I think they came in pink, 
as usual, and purple and blue. And then you can buy two and get a purple and a pink if you want to do it that way. So that's cool. Yeah, so I got that. And let me see. Uh, let's see what this is. All right. This is a big box here. And this is my last, well, last one in this bag. All right. I wanted to see if these were going to work. These go in your cabinets. They are racks that you put your dishes up. I was trying to see, well, if I can put my dishes on a rack, maybe I'd have a little extra room in my cabinets and make it look a little neater. It might be easier for everyone to get the plates out. But I don't know if this is going to work because I don't measure. <laughs> I assume. And when I don't measure, things don't go the way they should. <laughs> right? So... These are racks. Yeah. So what, what did I pay? I pay $18.47 and you get three pays for the metal plate holder racks. So what you do, you put your plates in here. I think it goes like this. Let me see how it goes. Uh, yeah, it goes like that. And then you put your plates in here like this. And um, yeah, they gave you two the same size and it gives you a small one, I guess, for smaller plates. So my worry is that my shelves are not that far apart. So if I put my plate in here is my is is am i going to hit the top of the shelf now my shelves are adjustable i can move them but um we'll have to see see how it works let me get a plate and and show you how they go in so at least you know that now they're showing round plates on here so we'll see if it works hold on So, I have two different plates here because really I have three different plates. Here. These here are my mums. I tried to sell them, couldn't get rid of them, so I decided to use them in my kitchen. The only reason I wasn't using these is because my kitchen ain't blue and white and kind of I was trying to match. So, I bought these a while back. Hold on at Dollar Tree for $1.25 and they're white so they go with everything. They go with everything in the kitchen and that. So these are more square. Are they going to work? I don't know. I don't think so. I think this is, I don't know. Let's see how it works with the plates. Now they work better probably with the round and the square ones. But I don't know. I have no idea. Yeah, see, it wants to slip, but maybe if I put two together, you know, you're supposed to be able to put, I think, four in here. Do I have them wrong? I'm trying to see. Let me see if I have them in wrong. Uh, no, mm -mm, that's the way to go. But the thing is, yeah, see, I think they're supposed to fit in the grooves. So our plates are bigger than what this is. So don't do what I did. Don't buy these. if Unless you got very small plates. Now let me get a small plate for this one and see if that'll work. Because you go this way. That's And then you put your plates in this way. Right? I could probably make these work. Hopefully, 
I don't know. Okay, so as you can tell, I have two different plates. I have these white ones. I only have a couple of these, and then I have hers middle plate. I didn't buy the smaller plates in the white. Um, I just never needed them, and um, but I put these in there. You know, we use these for sandwiches or something. But um, and then you have this little rack. It's supposed to be for the smaller plates. But even that, let me show you guys a little bit better. Even that, you know, is this going to work? I don't really like it. I know this is not going to work. The bigger ones won't work unless I move my shelf up. If I move my shelf up, then my cups won't fit on the rack that I have them on. So I'm probably going to have to send this back because I don't think it's going to work for me. Um... Not for my dishes. That's a shame. But I don't like how these are not really sitting where they need to either. Well, I guess that's the way they do it. They just sit like that. And then you put this one in. And then you, you can put more in there. You know? I don't know. Let me get a couple more of the small ones. And see, so you put these here. I mean, these. Ugh. And, I mean, you do got lots of room. And you can lean them, I guess, like that. If you don't have many of them. But, is this dangerous? I don't know. I see, I lay them flat in there. And that's how I have them. But I was trying to make more room in there. When you have a small house, you try to make as much room as you can for things, especially when it comes to the kitchen, because you just, yeah, you just get, you know, all kinds of dishes, and I have her dishes, I have my dishes, and it's just overwhelming sometimes, and I was trying to make more room. I think this will fit in the cabinet with no problem, but the bigger ones, I can't even get the dish in long ways without um, even with the even with the out this so uh, it, it's not going to work so I'll probably send this back but um, <laughs> right now it's sixteen sixty four and uh, you get three pieces and I paid more than that I paid eighteen forty seven for it. Um, yeah, so, uh, did I get a crisis restaurant on this? I did get, I got one for nine cents and one for two dollars and forty six cents. So, um, I'll probably send these back. I do have another one that I bought. I don't, hopefully, it's not the same friggin' ones. I don't know how I did it, but I got another set here. I think I forgot that I put these in the basket and bought these, and then I realized after that um, I had just bought another one. And they haven't come yet. Yeah. And these the same ones, I think so. Let me look. Um, yeah, they're the same ones. So I'm going to send these back because they're just not going to work for what I want. And even if I move the dishes, let's say I move the dishes to the second shelf, move my cups down, which would help my mother a little bit getting a cup, but it's not going to help her getting a dish. So I don't know. I have a dilemma, a big dilemma. So I'll figure it out, I guess, or I'll send these back. Anyways, guys, that's it. That's all I have. Oh, no, it isn't. I have one more. Let me turn this off and get rid of these dishes and put them back, and I'll open up the last one. Okay, sorry. All right. Well, this last one is for Shea Bear, and he ordered this. This is not what I ordered. He doesn't know it came. I did not know it was coming today. Uh, let me see if I can find it. 
Um, oh, there it is. There we go. All right. This is a carburetor kit he wanted. He asked for this and asked me to go on Timu to find it. So I went on Timu and I found him what he wanted and he I showed it to him and he picked the one he wanted. So he paid $21.41 for this. So I'll open it up and show you guys and then he can show you in more detail because I really don't know what he wanted this for. All right, so you get all kinds of stuff in here. But for the men who are interested, these are little air filters, I, I'm assuming, that you get. And what's in here? Let's see. Okay. I don't know what this is. What is that, guys? The men might know. Ah! All right, so... You get this to go with it. it. Looks like some kind of mount. This was thirty nine eighty nine, and he he paid. What did he pay? He paid twenty one forty one for it. Oh, well that oh he had, got a spark plug to go with it. It came out of its package here. Yeah. So, you get that. You get these clamps. So, it looks like he has a little case. I'm not going to open it up. If you guys want to know more in detail what it is, then you can go on his website, which is Shaver 1000 And I'm sure he'll do some kind of review or show you guys. And this is like a little filter, I think. And here's the big hun hunka thing, the carburetor part, I guess. And oh, this is the carburetor right here. This is what he was looking for right here. So any guys that are looking for carburetors and stuff, you can find them on Timu. Just to let you guys know. So I got that for him. And of course it gives you these little filter. The, oh, what do you call those things? You know. You men know. And then it gives you screws and stuff like that. So so he got everything I think he needs. Hopefully. Hopefully this will work for what he wants it for. And um, yeah. So I'm sure he'll go over this a little bit. But um, I think he couldn't find what he wanted and he found this on Timu, so he, he thought he'd get this. That's what he did. All right. Ooh. Things never go the way you want them to go back in the package. No, oh, never. Never. So that's all, guys. That's all I got this haul. I thought it was a pretty good one. I'm disappointed. Disappointed in the racks. I'm disappointed in this clothes hanger. Cheap, cheap, cheap. I will give it a bad review. I can tell. Look, it's already falling apart. Yeah, see? It just fell apart just by doing that. So how does they think this is going to hold clothes, you know? Really cheap. Oh, I could make something like this easy. So not happy with this at all. But I'll probably keep it. And um, and it was supposed to have two pieces. only has one. So, you know, when you say two pieces, I expect two pieces. If it says one piece, I expect one piece. Um, you know, weird. So I'm also disappointed on the size of these. But I will use these. This will be fine. And I am happy about my little butterfly. It is good quality. I think it will be fine for the back of my phone. This is probably my favorite out of this haul. Well, not really. My favorite is this. This is really good. I highly recommend this. This is really nice. If you want a cover for your, your laptop, I would get this. I like it a lot. They have all different kinds of them there. But I didn't want anything too big and bulky. 
I just wanted something flat that I could slide my laptop in and we go somewhere, you know, we're away for the weekend or something and I want to edit something. Or if I even want to do a live maybe in the motel room and I want to use my laptop for that live, I can do something like that. So, yeah. Well, that's it. That's all I got for now, guys. I do have many more coming. And, um, yeah. And I'm excited. We're going to go to Mount Dora for Halloween. And we're going to film that. We're doing a, um, a ghost tour in Mount Dora. And we're spending the night in a haunted hotel up there. So um, stay tuned for that. That'll be fun. I'm looking forward to that. So that's it, guys, for now. Um, like I said, she's out. And hope you have a great rest of the week. And until the next time, bye, y'all. Thank you.